guys welcome back to my channel once again it's a girl Bungwa Ozoibo you guys you know like how um, during pregnancy you know women lose their skin their body all a part of the good sacrifice this one makes while pregnant and then after pregnancy some of those things are trying to get them back yeah one of the major things I've had issues with during pregnancy as in the pregnancy hormones always disturbs me with is um, hyperpigmentation I stretch max is always a must loose skin as in, after my tummy goes down I think that's basically the issues I have after childbirth the um, breast one is a, a whole different class on its own but these are the major issues that I've, I, I have that repeated themselves with um, the two pregnancies so um, what do I uh, the first one, the first pregnancy, I didn't really bother myself about doing anything about skincare. If you notice most times, um, this cheek was always darker than the rest of my body. That's after that, uh, after my first pregnancy. So this time around, I don't want to take chances. I want to work on my skin. And uh, normally, if you know me, you know I'm someone that I love organic products. I was once a cosmetologist, so I do mix them myself. But with this pregnancy, I didn't have time to do that. I still don't have time to do it, I've been lazy about it. So I wanted to try the normal skincare, the chemicals and whatever it is that they are, the molecules, whatever it is that are being mixed. I wanted to try that aspect, I didn't have time. And being that I didn't have time, I didn't want to buy, I don't trust any organic skincare product in Nigeria. I don't know what they are mixing inside it. So I do not want to try any one of it. So I wanted to do the conventional one and I had to contact my friend Obioma. She's a pharmacist, she's very, very good with skincare recommendations and all that. So I had to contact her and she recommended them. Most of the products I bought are recommended. I've not tried them before. This will be my first time. I just want to share with you guys what I'll be doing to get my skin back. Um, I'm going to be trying them. If you know you've tried any of the products, please let me know down below how you how it went for you. I really like to know about them. But as she gave me the recommendations, I went online, did my own research, had um, some reviews, and that strengthened what she said. And that was why I got the products to use for my skin, especially my face. Hyperpigmentation is a bitch to me. Like this, this is makeup. I use wax and clean up my makeup. So you guys see what my face looks like before. Uh, before I start using this product. So if it works, you guys can tell me. Um, I, I also got skin tags, a little bit of skin tags somewhere here, here, and I think here, I don't know. But I got a few skin tags. Yes, so I'll be showing you guys the skincare products right now. So please wait, wait, uh, let me get the products. So guys, I am back. <laughs> Let me show you guys these products that I'll be using. I think, um, let me show you guys these products. Okay, this is um, Medix 5.5 Vitamin C Plus Turmeric. This is a body cream that I'll be using this here. This is the body cream that I'll be using. Um, the cream says on his body is a firming and brightening cream, transforming vitamin C lotion, promotes um, bright and even tone. And that's what I'm looking for. Happy pigmentation, remember. Um, antioxidant turmeric supports firm, youthful looking skin. Yes, saggy skin, pregnancy, added weight. You know, like now I have baby fat. And I said I'm a baby fat, I'm not still working out or anything, that's all still there. And as I'm losing weight, the skin tends to lose its tone. Yes, so aside also exercising to tone up the muscles and all that, I need something topical also to help my skin, yeah. So it also works for me then, it features revitalizing skin plumping moisturizers. Whatever that means. But <laughs> I got this brand of me, this 5, five because out of all the other ones I saw, this was what fits what I'm looking for in a body cream. So I'll be trying this out for body cream. I got this good molecules, niacinamide brightening toner for my face, the hyperpigmentation on my face. Mm, on his body, it says it's formulated with niacinamide, vitamin C, arbutin, and licorice root extract to brighten and improve appearance of enlarged pores. 
my face is very rough from pregnancy it's hormonal so uh my friend recommended this i have not tried it before like i told you guys i have not tried it before this will be my first time trying it out so i hope it's it does what it says because I heard a lot of reviews. I heard a lot of reviews and there was a lot of rave about this product. So let's see. I'll keep you guys updated. Let's see if it does what it says it's gonna do. Um the next one I have is this vitamin B3. TM vitamin B3 sus. It's also a serum for an even skin tone. He says on his body the concern is on even skin tone. Benefit it lightens skin and dark spots. I put pigmentation all over my face. It's still a face serum that I'll be using for my face. I, I heard a lot of rave about this vitamin B3 sauce. That it works, this, this, that, that, that. So yeah, I'll be trying it. I'll be trying it. I'll keep you guys updated too on how it goes. <laughs> the next product I'll be trying is Zabzit Acne Wash Cleanser. Some people swore by this product. They said it's a holy grail. You know? It contains a um, 2% salicylic acid. Yes, yeah, so it says on his body, um, clinically proven, safe, and effective and sensitive skin. My skin is somewhat sensitive. So that was why I got it. I was trying to, I was weighing between this and the NK list salicylic um, cleanser. But I said, let me just try this first because there was a review I read about this the, the girl was swearing by you know just how a lot of people that it does this does, does that blah 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 I don't know I've not tried it so I'm going to be trying it now giving you the individual review of how each of them went so uh, let's keep our fingers crossed for this I hope it works the next is my sunscreen I saw a lot of sunscreen I wanted to get a few but I found out that a lot of people were actually talking about this aqua sun gel SPF 50 plus PA plus 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 this sunscreen so it's an all-round safe block dermatologically tested Misha that is Misha Aqua 50 plus they said the sunscreen doesn't have doesn't leave a white cast it's not um, heavy it's lightweight I hope it's lightweight because one of the reasons why I don't like doing um, a complex skincare routine is because of um, I don't like feeling my skin feeling heavy and then I uh, sweating a lot I don't like that so they I hope this delivers on this promise um, that it's lightweight and all the others if it's not lightweight then it's not for me I'm going to stop it I hope they're all lightweight so the next I'm going to be trying is this Timeless Vitamin C Serum. This Timeless um, Vitamin C Serum, I'll tell you why I, I like this serum. My friend, like I said, Obioma recommended this serum. But one of the reasons why I like this serum is because I, I, I did cosmetology one time. I knew that Vitamin C is unstable and then it colors if you leave it, if you leave it um, open. but all the vitamin C serums I was seeing, they were in droppers and I know they'll be exposed and they might somewhat change color in the future. But when she told me about this timeless, it's closed. You can see it's closed. There's no room for it to, for light to go inside it to oxidize and all that. I like the packaging. I've not used the products yet. So like I said, all this, I will tell you guys when I use the product and see if it works. So I'll be keeping you guys updated if they work the last that i'll be trying is this tree hot cotton candy share share sugar scrub obviously before i know that before i start applying any kind of skincare i need to exfoliate like two two times a week but at least once a week i need to exfoliate so i just went for a regular scrub that i'll be using for my skin before i start i've not started anything so before I start any of this, I'll be exfoliating. What do I love about this? Nothing else, aside the fact that it smells heavenly. That's the only thing I like about it. And that's basically it. I'll be keeping you guys updated, up to date, about how it's going, how I felt about all the skincare products. That's basically what, what, what I showed you guys are basically all I bought. I'm mostly concentrating on my face. Yes, to see if I can get it back. That's all. That's all, guys. Hold on. Let me show you guys what my face looks like before. Let me wipe all this makeup away so you guys can see what my face looks like before I started 
this whole treatment. I really need you guys to see it. So, so if there is a change, you would tell me on time if there's a change. You guys, you guys hold on, let me go to the mirror and clean it very well so you guys get to see what my face really looks like now. So guys, this is what my face looks like without makeup. I'm still trying to see if I can get out the last of it so you know that. Every damn thing is out. This is what it looks like. You can see that here, here is darker, like my face looks darker. Here is darker than the rest of my face. Also here and my neck, also my neck and my shoulders are a bit darker than usual. It's supposed to meet every pregnancy. So yeah, this is what my face looks like without the whole makeup. So if I use the products and they actually, my face actually improves, I hope you guys would notice it. Let me come closer so you can see. Here is darker than the rest of my face. My face is super, super rough. It's very, very rough. Um, you can see I have got skin tags here. There are skin tags here. There are things somewhere here. And then it's just generally rough and darker. So this is what I'm hoping the products are going to help me with. When they do, I'll let you guys know. Please do not forget to like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe on this channel so I can be giving you guys more content. Please, guys, please subscribe on the subscription button. Please, guys, thank you. Bye bye. <laughs>